What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah. If you are here, if you've clicked on this video, I'm guessing you want to hear more about hair extensions. So let me tell you about mine, why I chose great lengths and why you should choose them too. So here's the thing. I've had three different kinds of hair extensions. I've had clip-ins. They were great for what I needed. I've had the hand-tied rows. They were okay. And now I have the their Keratin Bond Fusion individual extensions. So if you've never heard of these, they're pretty freaking awesome. I never heard of them. I kind of happened upon them on social media, inquired more about them, read more about them, and I fell in love with them. So I'm getting ready to get my third set. My first time through, I had them for just over six months, and my second time, I'll have had them for about five months. So um, this video is gonna be the first of a two-part series, just talking about maintenance, what it really looks like to take care of hair extensions and what a four to five month grow out looks like. So the thing about these extensions, they truly are super low maintenance. Um, for those of you that know me, I love looking cute. I love getting dressed up, doing my hair, doing my makeup. But at the end of the day, I'm actually pretty low maintenance, believe it or not. I just don't like to spend a lot of time getting ready. I don't want to have to do my hair every day. I don't want to have to just go crazy. And I don't want to have to be super careful with what I do with it. I, um, I'm i a working mom, so I get up every single day. I'm in the hospital. I wear a scrub cap. I come home. I work out quite often. We love to go out on the lake. I get it wet. We go play tennis outside. So we are always active doing things. And the last thing I want to think about is not messing up my hair. That That's just like so low on my priority. But I still like to look cute. I still want to look good. I still want my hair to look stylish. So... I found great links. So hair extensions to me are one of those things. Some people kind of look at it and scoff. To me, it's fun. It's just like coloring your hair, cutting your hair. Hair extensions kind of give you length for an added style for that specific style. But the problem is some hair extensions can actually really damage your hair, can give you headaches. I had clip-ins and they give me bad headaches. I had the rows where they sewed them in. They gave me headaches and I had to move them up every six to eight weeks, and my hair got really gnarly after a while. So I kind of got out of hair extensions for a while and I found these, so I wanna talk to you about these. So this video, part one, I'm just gonna show you getting out of the shower, what it's like to brush my hair, blow dry it, and style it. Super quick, low maintenance. I wash my hair at once every four days maybe, and, um, and that's it. So. I'm gonna show you guys this. Um, don't forget to subscribe to this channel just for more lifestyle content and like this video, you know, help a sister out. Head over to my Instagram. So on my Instagram, I kind of just do a lot of daily stuff. I do, I do lifestyle, I do hair, fashion, work, mom life. Um, so head over there. I will be documenting all of this next week, getting my extensions replaced. Um, and then also just maintenance of it all. So here is my Instagram handle, head over there. Okay, without further ado, part one of hair extensions. Let me know what you think. Okay, I just got out of the shower. I haven't washed my hair, felt so good. So really the only thing that you have to be careful with with these kind of extensions is, I mean, you don't have to be super careful, but you don't wanna pull super hard on them. Obviously, if you pull hard, you could pull your hair out. So after the shower, what I just wash them normal, what I would my normal hair. Um, I use Olaplex shampoo and conditioner, everything Olaplex, love it. Recommended by Marie. So when I brush it, when I get out of um, the shower, I just use a wet brush um, to get all the tangles out. So I just start at my base, get all my hair. And when I'm using my wet brush, I'm careful not to get the bond, like to brush the base of my hair where my extensions are. I can on the top, but um, where my extensions are, I try not to go to the base, like where my bonds are. And I'll show you those. And I actually have, she has a very specific brush they use for the base. So when you get these extensions done, they say they are like normal hair, no extra upkeep. The only thing 
you need to do for maintenance is brush them, brush them often. The idea is that the um, you want to keep um, your hair and it like just all mixed and not, um, it can get like tangled together over a longer period. I noticed, so my first time around when I had them, I noticed that like maybe month five, cause I went all the way, actually I went past six months. Um, if starting about month five, I noticed the roots were starting to get a little extra tangly and I felt like I was having to like really brush them a lot. And then um, towards the end as well, I just felt like the hair just looked stringy. Um, but I went all the way to six months. This time I'm getting them switched out at five months. So they tell you, okay, and so here's the extra brush and it's really gross and dirty, but um, it's the, it's their specific brush for their extensions. So this one, you can go all the way to the roots. And then I brush it. I've got a lot of the tangles mainly out. I think the thing I was surprised of initially, I thought I had to be like so gentle and so cautious. And whenever I now go to get like my hair colored or anything by Marie, she literally treats them like normal hair, you know? So initially holds the hair to brush, you know, but once you get all the big tangles out, it's like normal hair. So I'll show you guys up closer. Let me see. Let me grab a hair clip. All right. So I just want to show you guys what a four month grow out looks like. I'm just going to grab this hair. My obnoxiously big. Okay. Pull you closer to me. So, if you look closer, that's an extension right there. That's a bond. There, uh, there's one. There's one. Like, you literally can barely tell. Um, I love them so much. You can run your fingers through. So, I actually have had rows before where they did the um sew-ins and i cannot even tell you how much more i like this so this is what happens once you get closer to the end this is what happens right here they start getting just a little gnarly just matted so you have to really make sure you keep it all brushed out and you use this specific brush and you literally go to your roots and brush through and that helps keep all the bonds separated so so there's a bond and it's so cool how they do it. Like she literally uses this keratin bond fusion and with a hot tool um, melts the keratin to your hair, but it's a keratin treatment. So it doesn't burn your hair, doesn't damage. It just grows out with your hair. So you can see that is my, the bond is right here. And that's the amount of growth I have so far. It is so cool. So she does it all throughout. I'll pull you back. So my natural length let me see if I can find some natural hair it, like literally I can't even find my natural hair half the time because the hair is such good quality all right let me find my natural hair mm. right here okay so this is my natural hair so my natural hair goes to about there so I have had these trimmed when I got them colored, so they are a little shorter. Next time, these were the 16, which probably came to about here, and I'm going to get the 20 next time. So my extensions will be quite a bit longer than my natural hair, but these are only a couple inches longer than my natural hair. So I just love them a lot. Gives good volume, um, just fullness. So yeah, that is about, so this is about a four month, uh, just over four month grow out. And like I said, I'm gonna get um, at five months, I'm gonna get them taken out and put in. And I will be doing it all on YouTube. I'll do a big YouTube video of the whole process. I'm so excited. So anyways, check out Great Links USA on Instagram. Check out Marie. I'll put her link right here. She is incredible. She's been doing this for over 20 years. She is an expert. You guys know me. I have my teeny, teeny, tiny little history of hair back in the day. Um, 
I know enough about hair to know the lingo, to know, you know, who knows what they're talking about and who doesn't. And Marie is an expert. So anyways, check her out. I'm excited to show you guys my new extensions. Right. I love my hair after I blow dry it. It's just so fluffy and healthy feeling. So cute. Okay, I just finished blow drying my hair. Um, so I wanted to show you guys my bun. So this is, like I said, um, just about a four month grow out. I will be getting them replaced at five months. The, this hair is not, you guys will be able to see better. This hair is not like reusable. So every time they take the hair out and put new hair in. So let me show you guys the bonds. So it's obviously is all my own natural hair. I'm going to flip over. You know, they're really good, like, when you have to look for them. <laughs> so, that's an extension. And the bond is right there. There's a bond. If you get really close, you can kind of see it right there. That's my natural hair grow out. So, there are those, like, all throughout my head. You can see one like upside down. There's one. Like, and there are a ton all through my hair. But the great thing is, is like, they are so small and natural looking. I can put my hair up. Can't even tell. Like, where are they? I don't know. Whereas when I had like strips of extensions before, I had to work really hard to like, when I would pull my hair up, like tied it, but here you, you like, you literally, like you have to be looking for it really closely. There's one. <laughs> so they are, they're all and obviously I have a lot more like in the back and down here um this is all my natural hair like around my face and then she starts them about here or so and just works them in so yeah so this is a four month grow out um I literally I think the important thing to know is like with these extensions you can do anything with them. I, we live on a lake. I go out on the water all the time. I don't ever not get in because of my hair. I don't um, ever not wear a hat, not go to the gym. Uh, I mean, the only thing I probably would say is I probably brush my hair a little more than I used to, but that's, you know, they really encourage at least in the morning and at night. A lot of times halfway through the day after I work out or something, I'll brush it out. Um, they encourage you only to wash your hair every three to four days, which that's kind of pretty standard for what you should be doing your hair anyways. Um, 
I did learn that you can't really color them super great after you get them. Like you can color your hair around. So if you do get your hair color, make sure you go to someone who is recommended, who's familiar with great lengths extensions because like I got my hair highlighted later and she was real careful not to color any of the extensions because they just don't color evenly. Um, so yeah, these are my extensions getting them done i'm so excited we're going like even more blonde next time it's just fun i have always loved switching out my hair i think it's fun i don't get too attached to anything so yeah i love them if you guys are curious about them go on instagram check out marie i will put her link right here um, and then go check out Great Links USA. They're wonderful. I love them so much. Obviously not sponsored by them or anything. I just really like their product. I'm someone who, when I find something I like, I will tell everyone about it because it's great. I enjoy it. You should feel good about how you look. And um, yeah, and don't forget, try this stuff out. It's awesome. Can you see it? Olaplex Bonding Oil. Thank you.